Spotify listeners, thank you so much for coming back. Our Spotify rap numbers were very good. We have a lot of Spotify listeners. We'd have more if we release more episodes. We'd release more episodes if Specs respected other sorry, people's sorry. time. So how He's many? A very selfish. Okay, man. cool. Because you know me, I have no idea of Spotify listeners and all this stuff. So how many people are listening? Unique people, like people that follow in. There's about fifteen thousand that just listen uh, regularly. So if they will give me a pound, that means I've got fifteen k in my pocket. Probably. I ain't got 15k in my pocket, so what you got more mean? than 15k in your pocket? No, from I'm talking about from this Spotify. From, don't, from bust, this Spotify. don't bust that. Cat. Stop <laughs> that. Cat. From this Spotify, listeners. <laughs> I don't even have Spotify on my phone. Honestly, I don't understand what this thing means. No, that's fair. But, I, do, um, I do listen to music. YouTube. I go on YouTube and it means so that means if my phone rings, or how I are can't. we the same age? <laughs> You're so old. <laughs> so when his phone rings, what? So if I were to go what's up and out, the music has to turn off. You're so old. I've got to go to a different room. And of course he doesn't listen to music in his car. He listens to Capital FM. Uh, like cl classic, classic FM. FM. Classic FM. You know me. You know so me. So you listen to the radio. Yeah. And when music's, you're listening to music, you can't because you need to switch apps. Absolutely correct. You're so old. And you've got adverts. Oh, oh, you have to have adverts. You need to know what's coming out. <laughs> what do you mean? Manscaped. What version is out? <laughs> I need to know. Movies. Adverts are class. Bring more adverts, by That's the way. That's a good point, actually. Mm. You're a big Avatar fan. Mm. And the new uh, Aquaman's coming out. Have you watched any of the Aquaman films? The new Avatar's coming out, but Aquaman. No, 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 no. How is that? How is Avatar Aquatar together? No, I was no, waiting. No, you're, to... you're, you're a big Avatar fan. There's yeah. A, there's a lot of water and heroes and flying. I have not seen around. Aquaman. It has to come up on my on my algorithms, algorithms of adverts. You might want to watch Aquaman, you know. Seriously, how if you like Avatar, you might want to watch Aquaman. I need that because I've got so much. Why is, why is Miles ringing me? I don't care. Answer. It could be about, he knows my boy. Answer, answer. He's probably just asking for some bullshit. Miles! Hugo is rattled. Yes! <laughs> <laughs> what did... <laughs> Miles, no, Miles, no, Miles we're in the same room. Out. We're in the yeah, same room. I'm definitely not. <laughs> he's out. He's out. He's out. He's out. Miles, I'll call you back. <laughs> we'll do what you're going to in a minute. <laughs> My, you two what did you do? each other for everything. No, what did you do? I said, we're not doing that thing in the WhatsApp group. We're not going to talk about what it was. But I said, no. I said, I don't like it when this oh, person does about, this no, stuff. No, he's not talking about that. Yes, he is. Something's happened on Twitter. No, You're that's, getting that's, no I'm not. I'm not is even it? on Twitter. Oh. He's talking about that. It's a shit file. And this is what you two do. Oh, what a day, man. What a day. Uh, but yeah, Spotify listeners, Apple podcast listeners, thank you for being here. YouTube viewers, you guys are the most important. I'll be real. Um, you guys have been here from the start. No rules. Sorry, man. Yeah, sorry. Uh, all you listeners, man. I, I was unaware. No, I was aware, but I was unaware of the numbers. 50,000 a lot. So, yeah, just send yeah, me a pound each. Yeah, it's growing as well. We, it, we, it's, it's had bigger moments, but obviously mm. we, we're very inconsistent with yeah. releasing episodes. Send me money. You're scum. Yeah. yeah. Send me money, man. Uh, Filthy Five, new shirt uh, out now. Filthy5.com, our biggest ever release. It's custom. We've never had this level of customizability. Umbro, new partners. Uh, you're going to see some massive, massive work from us and Umbro in 2024. Can I just say... It's been a great year. It's been our best year, yeah. Oh, not, no, no, I don't know about you two. It's been his best year. <laughs> but my year's been, how can it be your best year if you touched God's nail? That, that makes, His toenail, that you makes touched it, it. That makes it better. And came back down. That makes it better. What do you mean? How can that be a great year? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> what? You look like Jordan. Oh. You look like a Jordan sign. <laughs> <laughs> and T, you definitely had a bad year. My Why? year's been incredible. Why has my year been bad? Why has T God's year been bad? What did Tigo do again? Why was he had a child? He had the toughest week of his life. Oh yeah, you had a child. Uh, with the spirit, you had a child with the in the spirit though. Mm. Look, this is a no rules gift. Oh, for you are. Oh, but you know, you're a good man. You yeah. know, you've had you a great year. Got you a card. I got this for our special guest poet. Who I thought about it. I thought, am I gonna say? Am I gonna let Spec say that he is later, didn't show up, or am I gonna say Spec's you two hours late? He couldn't wait around. Do you be, should, or should, am, are we gonna be, no, honest? Let's be, let's be honest? Let's be honest. Let's be honest. He said poet. Yeah, Christmas special. I said, cool, let's do it. Because he's, he's a Scrooge. Yeah. Came off the phone. I thought, you know what? No, no. No, no. You said, all right, I'll message them now. I'll message them now. Mm -hmm. I came off the phone. I went to Ring Poet and I said to myself, nah. <laughs> so crowd, just pretend he's here. Look how long his neck is. I don't want to see this guy. This is a No Rules gift. It's not just for Specs. It's for the whole No Rules team. But... Who's the, who's the, who, who, hold on one second. Who's the No Rules team? We got Jordy. Yeah. Greg, we got Dylan. We got Felix. Greg's not here. Where's Greg? Yeah. You're not part of the No Rules team though. All right, cool. Just, 
but we'll start here. This is a little gift. This is important to see the other side of the wrapping paper. Yeah, it's good quality wrapping paper, Hallmark. How you know it's Hallmark tea? Because I bought it. <laughs> oh, you wrapped this present? Of course. Tea, man. You know, your must spit is going to go away in 2024. <laughs> Inshallah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my days. Are you kidding me? <laughs> is this what we're doing? <laughs> Tigo has bought me. All right, give me one. 100.1. 20 burgers. Give me, give me, me one. one. <laughs> give me one. Give, go give, give me one. <laughs> go and give his dog one. Baba, man. give me one. Give me go one. Go give, give me one. Baba, give me a trolley burger one. Can I get this in my story? Can I get this in my story? Please. No rules. This is like, this is more important than the news I've got this morning. <laughs> yeah. You want one? <laughs> go on. Ah. <laughs> ah. <laughs> you made me feel better, bro. No way. Short friend, man. So, Julie, I've got your card here. I wanted to get you a gift, but I thought um, this is a gift for everybody, really. It's not. He's not going to share. He's, he's not. No choice. It's my armrest. Get a poet, it's my armrest. Poet, but my poet, present for Poet was a bit more meaningful. So I thought, I'll just give, let's give Julie a card. Can we open Poet's present? Nah. It'll, it'll have already have been on Filthy by now. What do you say? That's such a bit. Look, not even like, oh, Merry Christmas to the one of the guys that's got the biggest booties ever. It's yeah. not even, this ain't Hallmark. Oh God. That's not Hallmark, no. Tesco's is not near Hallmark to you. <laughs> right. Um, to Jordy, Merry Christmas. If you only have you for one more year because the stairs is calling, please make sure your fans know Wonder Kid is coming soon from Tigo. <laughs> When's Wonder Kid dropping? <laughs> <laughs> what? It's coming soon. Wonder Kid hasn't dropped yet. <laughs> he keeps dropping teasers. Merry Christmas, guys. Absolutely. Well, I'll just give you a Christmas present. So what happens if one of us hit the stairs? If one of us hit the stairs, yeah. then it's a classic. It's we, gonna it, do the biggest numbers in the world. Yeah, we just do okay, a, what well, if you do it, please? We do a voiceover. Well, what's, what's the, be honest, what's, what's going on, is, is Michael Jackson on it or something? What's, what what I'm is, saying. What's the big secret of Wonder Kid? Tell us. I'm waiting for one person. Is it a big, is it a big person? So it doesn't have a release date. It does. No, so it does. Because so it, yes. it comes out re re regardless. Ken Shamrock, CM Punk. Someone's coming back. Well, we're going to talk about that later. <laughs> it's important that we get into that. <laughs> but yeah, Merry Christmas, boys. You can give me my gift now. I didn't know. So your gift, how we, how, okay, just to let you know how, <laughs> just to let you know how our gifts work in my household. And I'm, I'm facts. I don't buy gifts, only, only for the kids. But we only do, uh, we, me, Janae, and Podosi do gifts. January sales. Give Dylan a trolley burger. Dylan, you want a trolley burger? Felix, you want a trolley burger? You sure? Felix, how come you don't eat sweets, by the way? You just ate like three bags of crisps, mate. I'm good. What's that got to do with eating a trolley burger, though? <laughs> Distribute the trolley burgers. <laughs> how many is in there, though? Do you know where I got that? Fantastic, man. Where would you have got that, T? That's yours. Well done, Dylan. Catch. <laughs> you <are> so <laughs> do you remember that one? Such a <laughs> to the girl that used to fancy. <laughs> You're childish. <laughs> all day till your arm hurts. Oh. And then all of a sudden, bam. <laughs> oh, man. Gimme. This is better than eating coochie, boy. You, you like coochie, isn't it? What's better? This or coochie eaters? Don't look at me like that, man. Be honest. You boys are coochie eaters. What's better? Trolley burgers or coochie? Please don't make me, don't make me expose on this show. All right, you lot are butt eaters. What's better? <laughs> Bum line or trolley burgers? So you're not a coochie eater? No. You swear? I swear. You know I'm not a coochie eater. All right, cool. What's better? Tea? Coochie or? Uh, out of what? what coochie, but, bum line or trolley burgers? Oh, trolley see, trolley burgers first. Like eat, you, you, oh, you, this guy you, 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 <laughs> Trolley burgers expert. first. Expert. You've made eating, <laughs> and expert. eating and eating are not the same in these two con contexts. Okay, sucking. Yeah, but you go on, suck a trolley burger. Oh. All right, that's, that's enough of that. Well, how, is that, how you lot suck bum lines? How you do it? Yeah, I don't think you suck bum lines. <laughs> <laughs> so suck why are you dead then? <laughs> why is your face down there then? You butt line eaters. Boys, I have an important question. Who's your person of the year? I asked the crowd. I got some terrible answers. Quick person of the year, so, someone person that of the year. the whole year has entertained you, or just somebody just that that that's for you. That's their year. But the thing is, mine keeps changing every month. Why? Because remember, we had a list of like 
people that had bad times. You know, remember we said we was gonna do a top 10 worst person of the week. Do you remember? Did we? You don't remember T? No. You don't remember? Flipping over you lot gonna. You gotta go soon. Um, person of the year. January to December, a person of the year. Yeah. Have you got one? Across all fields of industry, I'd rather not think about football. And you watch them, like you type them a lot on your YouTube. Maybe. It has to be a battle rapper, innit? But yeah, uh, you're, you're saying a battle rapper, that's a pretty poor answer. Yeah, no, it's not, yeah, it can't be. It's not. Who's, who's got me a semi? Who gives me a semi, man? Since January, like. No, it's just the truth. Who, who gives you a semi? <gasps> LA Knight. LA Knight's had who's a good that, year. That? The wrestler. What? <laughs> I don't think he's my wrestler of the LA year. LA Knight? Though. What, who's your wrestler of the year? Ooh, that's tough, but I think it, it, Cody Rhodes is above him. Oh, I hate his hair, man. I can't look at him. <laughs> I can't look at him. That's his dad's hair. Yeah, but it will suits his dad. <laughs> he looks like um, the bad guy in Yellowstone. Oh, what about um, Kevin Costner in Yellowstone? Yeah, was that this year, though? Well, it doesn't. for you it was this year. Was it? Yeah. Did I do that this year? Yeah. Actually, yeah, my no, didn't. Yeah, it was last, last year. year. No, I did it. Last year, you're right. Mizzy, he had a good year. Year or a couple months? He's still going. No, he's every in, time, he's every in time jail. he does anything, he becomes a national talking point. He's in jail now, though. Some man keeps changing, man. I can't remember who, who I liked in January and when December. It's tough to think of a name. It's not been a great year. Yeah, though, I don't it? think it's been a good on year. On paper. But you've been, but jordy has been like, I don't know, I feel like me and you have been, you've been like my Dazza this year. What? It could be you. Jordy. You be like my dazza. Reverse that. You don't even block me when I when I spank. <laughs> <laughs> you don't block. Everybody else, shield. Two, your arms up. Specs. One for luck. <laughs> you know what annoys me? I'm gonna let him land for the joke, but people are gonna tell me this later. What is when what I'm in is? Tesco. No, it's the truth though. I spank him. I've I've spanked everybody's backside on full fellas. You know, um, and there's some people that it's very hard to spank. Like Lippy and Margs, they let me know that. Listen, <laughs> the next time I block, nah. there will be fire on the block where Margs, you feel pain. Margs is usually no. Margs doesn't. Margs don't like it. Poet really poet will jump. <laughs> Tigo goes on a lap. It happens. Tigo can't be asked, and I like that. So <laughs> yeah, it's it's yeah. gonna happen anyway. <laughs> Oh. Um, Jordy, you laugh. You, you're the only one that laugh. You like you love it. <laughs> Shut up. What? Man. what? You laugh. <laughs> what are you talking about? Jordy, do you? <laughs> Dude, he laughs. Every time I do this, you flinch. Yeah, because that's you're gonna. I don't like fighting. Spanking. <laughs> yeah, but I'm gonna fight. I'm gonna fight you. A lot of people said you as man of the year, person of the year. I've had a great year. Of course, you, definitely. Man like Mobin. Sky. Was that this? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. It's been it's been a great year. It's been a great year, but it, it means nothing. Dad hit the stairs, gained a new family. Oh yeah, that's true. It's a big year for you. Yeah, it's a big year, yeah, you know, it is, you know, it's true. But I can't pick myself. You can't pick yourself, no. You can't but L's Ewol Wonder says Dylan. For what? What Dylan? Dylan's got man of the year. <laughs> <laughs> I I, well, I'll tell you what, what's his name? What's his name? <laughs> L's. L's, I'll, I'll be honest with you. Spanking Dylan <laughs> is one of the best spanks ever because it feels like you're slapping a bunch of marshmallows. <laughs> Powder everywhere <laughs> as well. <laughs> and he will let me know, you know what? Yesterday's spanking was better than today's. <laughs> you put too much power in that analysis. <laughs> <laughs> so Dylan, uh, Dylan, Dylan's, been a, Dylan's been a great guy. I went, anytime I was up at me, he, 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 he responds straight away. Shaka like a Luma says what? Miles, he opened and closed the door. Mm -mm. That's all he done. It's bad year, it took him too long to get a new phone. Yeah. It's bad year for Miles. Uh, Usama mentioned one of your former schoolmates. Not ones that are, but ones mm -hmm. that are. You can be certain, like, I went to school in the 1980, flipping 81. Nah, you went to school in the 2000s because you went to school with Francis Ngannou, right? Oh, oh that, that is class points. I that thought you were. Because Usama says he's man of the year. <laughs> <laughs> what about Chucky and Taze? Their events. Yeah, they've had a great year. Great year. I was on the phone Taze yesterday, man. Bless him. Bless him. Told him my battery was dead. But no, I won't. I just locked off. <laughs> <laughs> they got some nice t-shirts as well. They're going to do well. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, biggest Boy 2000 says Logan Paul made the UK go crazy over a drink. Great bags from boxing. Them, them suplexes the were best class. celebrity wrestler in WWE. Yeah. yeah Logan Paul's yeah. up there. 
Now we've got a he shot. Had, he had an amazing year. Yeah. Mm. He's one of the best wrestlers. He is. I think I this lie. year's Royal Rumble is going to be amazing. I can't lie. I think that's Eddie Guerrero. The new Eddie Guerrero. I don't know about new. I think. Clone. What, old? <laughs> no, no, okay. Well, yeah, I'm just saying. I just think Eddie yeah, Guerrero is, is, is under that mask. Oh, look, mum. Well. <laughs> Oh, you got the same yeah. chewing gum. Is that Sorry. really what you're doing? Oh, well, one second. <laughs> Did you say, oh, look, mum? Sound like he said no, mum. Sound mom. like he said mum. I'm like, I was about to, I was about to run. I was like, mum, are you hovering around me? Do you know what's funny is whenever someone says the wrong thing on <laughs> uh, Filthy or No Rules. It's recorded anyway. They'll say, I didn't say that. And now I watch it back and I go, you fully said <laughs> it's that. It's recorded anyway. James has made a good point on worst person of the year. He's gone with, he said not the worst, but he's wrong. He is the worst. Blanca. <laughs> Ash. Oh, God. Ash might be worse person. Yeah, Blanca's had a bad year. Bad year. Yeah. I mean, is it, Tio, 2024, are we going to bring him on? Oh, 100%. He has to come on. He just messaged me, actually. What did he message me? Yeah. Blanca's had a bad year. Just message him and say he's had a bad year. Oh, he's oh, okay. Effie's got to be up there. Effie's suggestion has got to be up there for Dazza because of that cigarette moment with Ash What's in it? Barcelona. I was like, well, Effie? You, why? I thought you was talking about Effie. Oh my God, that's another guy we're going to talk about one day. Sorry. Who the hell I, is I, Effie? It's, it's a, a black guy in Cali that's a proper white guy. And you thought that's who Tigo was Yeah, I was like, about. how does Tigo know Effie? Sorry, man. You think the whole world just revolves around Cali, <laughs> isn't it? <laughs> <laughs> but Dazza might be worst person this year. Dazza's worst person this year. Hamza's... Hamza's up there, uh, yeah. He's up there. He's up that's the worst person. The, person Hamza didn't even get into Dubai. Hamza couldn't get to Dubai. Yeah, he's not allowed. What? Because what? Because he was driving them times to court with PK. <laughs> Probably, I oh don't know. Oh God. Do you know who could be the worst person of the year? Dan. Vince McMahon. Obviously he had his charges. He came back with a moustache and black hair. Bad, bad. He's finished, man. And he sold the company. He's, he's finished. He's finished. I don't think he can put his clothes on himself. He's, he's, he's at that stage where he's just shaking. God. You know I read as, um, Kurt Angle told someone, I was going to say he told me, but he didn't tell me. He's done an interview where he was on so many painkillers that, <laughs> that he walked into Vince's office where all the agents are and just flashed his willy. He said, look what you've done to me. Wait, hold on. <laughs> Dylan, have you read that? Make yes. the pipe shrink. Apparently, um, he was so injured, his balls and his like, inner thighs were black. He was, he had bad painkiller addiction. <laughs> My love before. <laughs> He's got a black man's willy. <laughs> no, just balls. Just balls, he said. That's insane. Imagine waking up one day, you got a white willy or a black man. Flipping <laughs> hell, Didn't man. you think <laughs> Kurt Angle was black? I thought Kurt Angle was yes, black. Yeah, Jordy thought Kurt Angle was black. I can't believe it. Jordy, you crazy. Mooney me and you got a white man's bum. Oh my God. They even dry skin. <laughs> a full white man's bum. T, that's class. God, we're helping you here, man. <laughs> Oi, my next child, I hope that. <laughs> Upper half white, bottom half black. Apparently Vince saw it and said, right, cut, step into my office. <laughs> <laughs> but Vince, Vince offered him out, you know. Apparently Kurt used to phone him and just leave abusive voice. Yeah, that's what, that's what he came. So, so Vince, offered, Vince said, come into my office and then he opened his phone and showed him all the texts. So Kurt's saying, I'm going to fuck you up when I see you. I'm going to beat you up. I'm going to beat you up. So um, Vince goes, come then. One on one. <laughs> And apparently Kurt just cried. Vince can rock as well, apparently. Is it? Not Kurt Angle, though. Kurt Angle's something else. But how, so how, why didn't Vince get up from that punch from Bret Hart then? <laughs> he told, because he said to Bret Hart, you're allowed a free shot. And Bret Hart took it. You know you know, if somebody says you're allowed a free shot, it means they're rockers, but they're allowing you off. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. But a lot, of pe a lot of people say Vince McMahon would have taken Bret Hart that day. A lot of people say that. So he can rock. Do you think he could beat up Shane? Me? Yeah. I think he could. Not now. Now, like you say, he needs help. Yeah. No, he's shaking, man. He's shaking. Abdullah says bum out, worst person of the year. Did Trevor have his bum out for real, yeah? Or was that, yeah, that was real, yeah? yeah, yeah. I thought that was an edit. No. That's what I thought it was real. No, no, no. That's nice. That's nice, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so Trent might be your person of the year. because yeah, I like that, I game. like that, man. I like, you, you know, the top half peeping. Okay. And his bum was smooth. You know what I thought with it to you? Oh, man, if I was a linesman. Real spang. Let's see what marshmallow he's working with. 
I don't know. I'll, I'll, I'll T, are they tabs that you have open? Yeah. That is disgusting. It's just He's a lot. He's got tabs as well. It's a lot. That's a, all different calendars. Wait, that's more than 20 tabs, T. Can Wait you see? More. Can you see? He's got more than 25 tabs open. Can you see any of this? No, that's incognito mode. That's, that's Twitter. That's a Twitter logo. <laughs> no, no I know what he's yeah, asking. The original yeah. logo T from 1995 XP Windows. What X actually means? Oh, no. It's, yeah, it's not. I don't look up. T, that's too many tabs though. Uh, yeah. T, just for my effort. Just, I'll, I'll T, sorry, sorry, just for me. Know. Just for me. Have you saw the seats this month? No. Have you saw the seats since you had your little one? No. Yo, that's why you're angry. So you, you said, you, you said, you said, you, you said, <laughs> you celebrate. <laughs> Are you celibate? celibate? <laughs> There's an alternative to be a celibate. So, you, oh, so you, 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 your hands not, you don't work no more. I've, <laughs> I've, I've not been a shoulder shaker for He's about uh, 15, 16 months. T, I don't think you're a liar, but I don't believe you. I understand why you would say that, but it, I, I, I stopped. It just, it, it was, it was over. <laughs> you, <laughs> ran, <laughs> you ran out. No, I had a child. He's got that no time. bullets left. <laughs> I had I had a child after I finished doing that. If anything, uh, it made me more fertile. Uh, T, just just for me, you, when you show the shit, you stand up or you sit down. Did that six months ago. Sit down. And you watching anything or yeah. imagination? No, I'm watching stuff. Yeah. Like, what's your category? I would usually go to the homepage and just see what looks right. <laughs> yeah, good thumbnail would do it. Yeah, 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 yeah. So you have to have five videos of a guy playing at once? No. You hover your no, clicker no, over. No. You, you, you'll make a short list and they go, oh, that's the one. You sweat? Uh, <laughs> no, I don't. I, I don't get that. Like, <laughs> I want to imagine T really ramming himself. People people like Moggs like to make the whole event like an hour long process. Yeah, but I want to know you. I want to know no, you. No, that's what I'm saying. I never understood why people like wanted to drag it out. So where's the T? All right, T, so... Are you, 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 you shooting toothpaste on yourself or you got tissue there? You got your kitchen roll? What's your, what's your- Ideally kitchen roll. To, to, to Ideally kitchen roll. Huh? Ideally kitchen roll. You got kitchen roll? Yeah. On, on your lap? <laughs> no. But- You butt naked T? You got your hoodie on? Definitely not butt naked. <laughs> I've, yeah, I've probably got a hoodie on. I'm not like you, again, you like to dress for the occasion. So you're, okay, so, all right, but T, what, 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 see me? Like, you know me, I will go in a group be like, boys, I'm about to show the shake, so I'm not messaging. You know me, I'm, I'm open with it and yeah, I'll do it. You're lying most of the time when you But say why it. are you secretive about when you're doing it? I don't understand. Why don't you put come in a group and say, guys, I'm about to go mad <laughs> with my hands. What? No. <laughs> <laughs> when, when was the last time, when was the last time you did that? Uh, no, no, 2024, we've got to switch it up. Like, crowd, go on Twitter and say, I'm about to ram myself. Uh, you see, you'll, be, see, you'll see how many people will be posting, oh, me too. <laughs> I don't want to be on that Twitter. No. Specs, no. no. I'm sure that Twitter exists, by the way. So you're still being secret. We're still doing secret shoulder shaking. It's, it's not even secret. Do you announce every time you're going to have sex? Yeah, but it's too late most of the time. If I'm going to have, you know, 1 a.m. and I'm going to go and give, give me sort of the real domination. <laughs> <laughs> the same position. <laughs> she, she wants to change. No. There are people that um, they treat shoulder shaking like a... Um, a motive, like a motive, like they get creams and like candles, candles. So you're, so you're, you're, you're saying, forget all that. Quick five minutes, I'm gonna hurt myself and I'm done. It's just it has to. Be, if you plan it, <laughs> hurt if, myself. If you plan to show the T, must hurt. T, you know how strong this guy. He must really give himself a dead leg. He's gonna wait now. I got Kurt Angle. <laughs> got a dead leg. T, there's no way Kurt you do, Angle. you're a soft, soft. You, 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 you're really, really K in your fire. <laughs> you got a dent on your fire, T. Oh. People who schedule their shoulder shakes, they're the psychos. What? <laughs> I'm, at me. I'm, looking, I'm looking at my card, you're pointing at me. What? You schedule your shoulder shakes, surely. No. Now I live with people. Obviously, there's less of an opportunity anyway. But when I lived on my own, it would still be like a spur of the moment thing. It wouldn't be like, ah, oh, I've got to go to gym, then I'm coming back and... Quick question, I asked Podolsi a mad question the other day. I was like, Podolsi, look, you know, there's a couple of mummies that I know, especially friends of mine, who they have vibe lighters and all this kind of stuff in their mm -hmm. house. And you know, in their time, when they're in the bath, they'll go and knock one out, which is normal. Podolsi, she's never done that since she was in like secondary school. Do you think that's insane? Never had 
she's never done but she hasn't got that stuff and she's never done that to herself well that means you're taking care of business man big up good on you is that what it means it must mean that is it so you're saying that all these mummies that go in the bathroom do that stuff is because they want to no 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 they got, they got i don't think they want to touch god's toe no, no 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 but they they've got boyfriends though the movies yeah, I'm talking about. I guess they ain't taking care of business. All right, that's what it means. Maybe you're taking care of business, man. So I love you. <laughs> I'm great in bed, Dylan. I'm great in bed, bro. Great in bed, Dylan. Jordy's <laughs> proved that I'm great. <laughs> what are you talking about? Just shut up, shut what? up. Right, well, people around it. You didn't say it. I'm great in bed, man. Thanks to Jordy. Boys, you know what it's time for? I can't even remember. I'm going to say remember wrestling. That's what it's time for. Ding, ding, ding. <laughs> Boys, so I've got a cousin, uh, my first cousin, who's a big wrestling fan. Oh, really? So he's been calling me every day, like, so what, have you been seeing that? And I've been like, ah, oh, keep forgetting. But we spoke about CM Punk coming back. And we love that about wrestlers. Wrestlers, they leave WWE, they go broke. Yeah. <laughs> and they come back. Class. Why the hell was Ken Shamrock? Coming back. I don't think he is. I think that was people running with a story that wasn't the story. I think he was, they've, they've cut a deal to sell his merch or something. Oh. Because UFC and WWE have the same owners now, and he was in UFC and WWE. What do you mean, same owners now? T, there's a company called TKO. T, 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 TKO, which is the union of WWE and UFC. No way. That's who Vince sold to. So Vince is not. I don't know, he's done anything. He's powerful, still up there. Apparently, I've read a thing today that he's still involved in day-to-day -day stuff. He's still very much involved. Bro, he runs wrestling. But Triple H is in charge of what's yeah. going on, like, out, out front. So what's CM Punk's, um, what's he been doing lately? I've, I haven't, I obviously saw him coming out with Survivor Series, I believe. Mm -hmm. um, but I haven't seen what, what he's been up to. Can I trust him? Because that's my problem with CM Punk. I don't know if I can trust you, because he, he's a bit of a, uh, like, loons. <laughs> He's hard to control. <laughs> Joey Barton. Yeah, Joey Barton. Balotelli. Can I trust him this time? Can Balotelli to go nice and do his thing? Yeah. Mm. Am I going to get that from CM Punk? Maybe he's got better with age. So he went to AEW. Mm. That always goes wrong. That's, the, that's a bad place to go, but he went there on a big wage. And um, basically, all the wrestlers over there that have never really been in big companies, mm -hmm. they didn't really like him because he was trying to be like, that's rubbish, stop doing that. Stop doing that. Make it more realistic. Boom, boom, boom. But you know what he's like in WWF with his sitting down, telling everyone what to do stuff. Um, and then he got into beef with them, but then they fell out and he disappeared for a little while. He came back, even though he was beefing with these guys, like behind the scenes. And then another one, one of the younger ones, whose dad was in Beverly Hills 90210, I think. Wow. Yeah. Uh, Luke Perry, brilliant. Luke Perry's son mm -hmm. in London, did a thing and he cussed him down the camera. Oh no. While he's backstage getting ready for his match with Samoa Joe. Now backstage, as he's walking past him, he says something to Punk. Punk says something to this guy. Punk beats him up. But, and then goes out and has a sick match with Samoa Joe, allegedly. I don't know, I don't watch this shit. Um, and then they had to fire Punk, but Brian, Dan uh, Brian Danielson, who's Daniel, Daniel Bryan, Bryan yeah. had to fire him. Okay, so hold on. Why is Daniel Bryan called Daniel Bryanson now? Because he doesn't own his name. WWE. Well, his real name's Daniel Bryan. Brian Danielson. This is, yes, yeah. yes. His real name is Brian Danielson. But in WWE, it's Daniel Bryan because they, they have to own the things that they put on their show, basically. Um, so he got fired. And now WWE obviously hasn't been on there for 10 years. He fell out with Triple H, fell out with Vince McMahon, uh, did a podcast that he got sued for, lost a load of money, um, daring out the business. Got, he's got released, got fired on his wedding day. Apparently, they gave him the papers while he was in his suit on his wedding day. Um, this but, man is rude <laughs> <laughs> on his wedding day. Yeah. But now he's back. But he said he's here to make money, not make friends. So, wow. so he's broke. He said that. <laughs> he's not broke. He is no, broke. He, is, he, is, he, is. he wants the money that they're taking off him for the wedding day, T. Mm, no, it's a story, isn't it? Oh, that's a storyline. Because on AEW, it was like friendly, but it all went wrong. So who's, now he's back and he's like. So who's, who's his. Um, he's a uh, like op now. Who's I don't think they've decided that yet. Right. Who know? do you think his op should be? Who's like Randy Orton? Can I tell you something I stored, boys? Battle rap. Yeah. Yeah. DNA versus Charlie Clips. You know them guys, right? Yeah. Charlie Clips is a legend and DNA's got one teeth. But they got a battle. <laughs> one teeth. They got a <laughs> they got a battle here. Mm -hmm. And um sorry T for the listener experience, but in the middle there's Samoa Joe. 
Samoa Joe's in battle rap. What? Samoa Joe's in the background. See, this is why the, the people that sound in the background is important. Very important. <laughs> yeah, it is. Very it important. Is. Samoa Joe is here. Look, bang. Oh, wow. So DNA started a, a wrestling battle rap card. Speaking of which, you know who came back to WWE the same day as CM Punk? Our truth and Randy Orton, but our truth. When did he go? Where did he go? <laughs> he just was out. He just was about. Who cares about him, man? Our truth is hilarious. If we talk about our truth. Just to, you know, there's a ba- is that a battle rap card where it's just only wrestling bars? Yeah. T, they have a battle rap just for some. You need to watch battle rap because they love wrestling too. They love wrestling. Remember, I told you. Anyway, back to our truth. What are the views on that? <laughs> <laughs> oh, T, you doing that? You doing? Um, no, I'm interested. I, I, I'm, I'm interested. interested. Nah, no, these are big. Free, free, free in a month. Okay, okay. Free, free, free in a month. I'm just not sure about battle rap. Free, free, free in a month. Professor Green. What? Is he a battle rapper? What? I'd, I'd, Is I'd, Professor Green a battle rapper? I ne- I wasn't tapped into UK battle rap. He was international. He was international he for me. Gin. He, ja- he, he clashed, he clashed gin. gin and Sirius Jones. He went to the final at the Mixtape Power Summit. T, you was in year four when, when this would happened. Cool. I've just never watched. I've never watched. By the way, Professor I ne- Green say, "I say, yo, I've I never, never watched." Pro Green is my guy. Yeah, because Seb used to manage him. So big up Pro Green. I never knew you were two years younger than Vince Man. <laughs> <laughs> I never. This whole time, I thought Pro Green was my age. <laughs> he is shaking it, bro. I think he wrinkles is. everywhere. I think he is your age because he was friends with Greg as kids. Look at what? Him. Yeah. Pro Look Green at him. Pro Green and Greg. They Pro- both used to inline skate or something. Pro Greg. I think if Pro Green walked out in Vincent City, we wouldn't know this. <laughs> I, you wouldn't know the difference. Pro Green and Vince coming out. Vince's brother! <laughs> <laughs> Vince he was brother. a secret owner. Yeah, they, they should do that. Vince does have a brother. Pro Green is the secret owner. <laughs> remember, you remember Vince's guys? Yeah, one of them. Pat there. Patterson. Pat Patterson. Pat Gerald, Patterson. Brooks Gerald Briscoe. Gerald, they were his, Briscoe with us. Pro Green get in there, man. Replace Patterson. <laughs> Pat Patterson was gay, innit? Yeah. That was a shock. Um, is that the one that announced it? Everyone, he started crying in front of everyone. I watched Dusty Rhodes talk about how um, he got talked into being gold dust. Dustin, Dustin Rhodes, Rhodes, yeah, Dustin yeah. Rhodes. Yeah. So Vince called him, WCW chucked him. Vince called him and said, I want you, because I hate WCW, I want you to come here and you're going to wear an androgynous costume. Dustin Rhodes doesn't know what androgynous means. No. Me neither. So he said, cool, cool, cool. He just wants money. Cool. Checks the dictionary to find androgynous. Says, what the f-? Yeah. <laughs> what does it mean? A neither male nor female kind of thing. You can't tell. So they stick him in his suit and said him, yo, Savio, I need you to go and grind up on Savio Vega. Go grind up on all them, man. Grind up on Scott Hall. Scott Hall's like, what? Yeah, no. He didn't, he didn't want it. Razor Scott Ramon didn't yeah. want it. Scott Hall's like, move this guy from me. What? <laughs> Razor Ramon said that um, he did one he did like one match with him. They started a storyline. He went home and his son was like, dad, what was that? And he was like, nah. <laughs> but it was the 90s. It was the 90s. <laughs> Razor Ramon. But the thing you got to remember is uh, Dust, his dad, Dusty Rhodes, was in charge at WCW. Vince McMahon was always trying to get one over them. So what they, he was the American dream. And what they did is make gold dust, the dream shatterer, the shattered dream. So it was all about like, you've ruined your son. And he took- and here he is, he's this, he's turned into this because you're such a bad dad. And he took it, he, took, he wasn't, he said, he, I'd be, I was beefing my dad when I took the job. Yeah. Cause so he's a weak dad, link, you know? His dad didn't like his wife. I just remembered why I loved gold dust. He was sick. Even though I didn't, I didn't understand the stuff he was doing. No. I loved it all because he was with, is it Tory? Terry Reynolds. T- oh. That was his wife. What? Yeah. <laughs> Real life. Yeah. T. I had did you see the clip of him this year? He married, he's married off. Like his daughter got married, and they did a wrestling. Yeah, yeah. In yeah, the yeah. wedding, yeah, they went viral. But Goldust was. If you watch that that early Goldust '96, '97, it was actually sick because he was like really made you really uncomfortable and was actually like kind of. Creepy. Yeah, he was. The work. Uh, he used to add like Tourette's to his um, speech as well. Oh, yeah, that was bad towards the end. That was bad. Yeah, they they, they should never have done that. But um, but he like um, because he was that mankind era, wasn't it? Early yeah. mankind, Undertaker. His whole thing was like kind of. It was kind of scary. It's because he was Hollywood, isn't it? His whole he was supposed to look like an Oscar. Do you think there's a wrestler that you'll cry if they um came back? <laughs> no, no, <came, laughs> went away. Yeah, I think Undertaker upset me. Undertaker still, yeah. but the thing is, all what, that uh, killing, all that killing, you, that you've killed him for a good three years. We're gonna take on it. Maybe Stone Cold. It would have to be a wrestler. It impacts my childhood. I feel like Stone Cold was Who would it be for you? the guy. 
I cried when Eddie died. You cried, yeah. You yeah, definitely you cried when young, Eddie died. You were very yeah, I was young. I was in year five. I was in year five. Eddie, yeah, yeah, yeah. Talk now. Hey, wait, hold on. When Eddie died, Eddie, when, Eddie, when, how many times was Eddie world champion? He was. He was exactly. How can you cry for something that won't even? Because he, he had it. Once? He had it he when he died. Sick. When he died, he was sick. T T, you got to be six, seven time world champion for yeah, me. Yeah, but you was you was in you was in college. Am I right, Dylan? You got to be six, seven time world champion. Right, to so be crying. Shea, are you going to cry when Sheamus dies then? Who? Sheamus. He's six, seven times now. Well, Sheamus is better than Eddie Guerrero. No, he's oh, not. No, no. <laughs> well, what about like uh, <laughs> Ted, 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 Ted DiBiase? Million Dollar Man. He never won a world title. He's in jail, you know. I wouldn't cry. Oh, yeah, I wouldn't cry for him. He's in jail. He kicked, he, 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 he kicked a, um, a basketball out of a, a little black boy's hands. Triple H, man. Triple H? Nah. You know he was an English guy? Mm-hmm. Yeah. Blue blood. Him and um, Re- Regal. Regal, yeah. The Rock? Do you know what? Something about The Rock is The Rock's not really done it for me. What is it? Because he was, it's a short period of time. He's he left early, man. Wrestler, yeah. He left the crowd early. loved The Rock. They loved The Rock. I know, don't get me wrong. When he comes back, like Sammy John Cena, when he comes back and you see the energy and everything, it's class. <laughs> Sticks John Cena. Don't, I, uh, don't mention that. I amazing. never really liked John Cena, but when you watch those moments where he comes back, it's undeniable. Oh, man. You know what we're going to do now, though? No Rules Sunday. Some No Rules News. <laughs> Boys, this is from the LA Times. A population of hard to eradicate super pigs in Canada is threatening to invade the US. Speaking of LA Times, I was so excited to see the advert of GTA 6. Oh yeah. And that's it, and it's in Miami. Yeah, I was gonna get to that, but yeah. What is the point of advertising a game like that and making me wait a year for it to come out? They do it every time. I don't know why people are so surprised by this. Yeah, Wonder Kid. And there's loads of things. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> GTA 6, yeah? And Wonder Kid, yeah? GTA 6 has got a release date, by the way. <laughs> um, they do this every time. And then over the year, they'll give you more and more. Like, there's so many. Have you seen people like analyzing the, the, the different screenshots from the advert? There's so many things in that advert that will tell you about what the next game is going to have. Do you see the alligators mm-hmm. and the. Um, that, that put me off. When I saw that, oh my God, you're trying to make, like, I've never ever played an Animal Planet game. There was a dog in the last one. T, shoot it, stamp it on the floor. No, you have to be it. Oh yeah, yeah, one of the scenes, you yeah, did, didn't it? Yeah. You don't know. That was rubbish. You don't know GTA Challenge. That was sick. What's the dog's name? Trevor, no, I was Trevor. <laughs> Trevor. Bruno. Tyson. Chop. Chop. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, I just want to let you know, I, I clocked the last Grand Theft. Everyone has. Yeah, cl- clocking single player Grand Theft is not hard though. <laughs> no, but it's long. Yeah. It's long. It's I did it, time. me. Yeah. With my attention span, I did it. You should be clapping. Well, that's what came no, no, out 10 years clap ago. Clap your cheeks for me, boys. You probably Shut came out of jail and like were on tag or something. It came he out 10 even years in, ago. It, it was before he was in jail. I'm going to wait till you clap your cheeks for me. I'm just, I'm, I just told you I've clocked it and you're arguing. Well, the thing is, you said you're going to buy the next one and I don't. I can't see you playing that. Yeah, I'm buying I'm, I'm going to buy a PS5 for myself for Christmas. Elias is going to be like, what? Four? Four, yeah. He can't play it. Layla could probably play it though. She played, she's she played, played, five, she played five. She played downstairs because of Felix and Greg, yeah. Um, Balancing the books. <laughs> what was the last game you clocked, Jordy? The last game I clocked. Clocked for Americans means completed. Um, ooh, um, WWE 2K, they always send me one. Oh, the- And I do the, I do the career mode. Career mode. Oh, yeah. I was just wonder if Greg would look after Layla for a couple hours in his house. I think that's a movie, you know. Do you think he would do that? Layla's quite easy to look after. Greg no, f- but can, would Greg do that in his house? If you asked him, probably. 2024, I'm going to put people in the would you rather? Would you rather Daz or Greg? Uh, definitely Greg. Definitely Greg. Greg and Layla's adventures. That, Greg, Layla would run rings around Daz. Daz has got mold everywhere in his house. <laughs> <laughs> Daz has got one towel. Yeah, what, like, there's steam. The kitchen rolls used in the toilet as well. <laughs> Daz makes egg in the toilet, man. <laughs> His toilet and kitchen's attached. Oh. Nah, mate, no way. Was it was GTA the last game that you completed then? Last yeah. game that you clocked? Yeah, I had GTA. Um, and there's another game I had. I tried to pl- play Red Devil Redemption's Red. Red, Red Dead. Dead Redemption. Red Dead Redemption. So Redemption. I tried to play that because that's like that's just, that GTA. That's GTA, but yellow stuff. Yeah, but I just felt like the, the sky was always too dark. It wasn't bright enough for me. But um, I hear that. Yeah. I, t- I tried Red Dead Redemption, but I, I never tried the second one. But it, it just took too long. F- you get on a horse, it takes too long mm. to get to something. Mm-hmm. And that just drove me mad. Claire Burrows has asked me to jump on Fortnite with her, like today. Apparently I'm she's just really like, good at it. 
Is it apparently? Is it? Chris said she's really good at it. No way. I, I think I think um, Fortnite is a very childish game. It is. It's hard though. Like very difficult. Yeah, just too much flying and landing. Yeah, and building. Right. What's that? The cameraman just Felix and Greg just diving with me, and we just land on the floor, and then it's nah. I think next week you should uh, next week next year you should try that. Try what, gaming. Things. Like a week you're a gamer. Yeah, next yeah. next week you're. I don't know. Yeah, astro- yeah. Astro- GT- astronaut? GTA Six. I'm on it. Astronaut training. Yeah. Astro- okay. The demo. Where's the demo? GTA Six. There won't, when be a, there, demos? Won't be, there won't be a demo. <laughs> demos. Oh, demos. Oh, demos. demos. They still do demos. Demos no, is close. Why? No way, really. Yeah, you go on the PlayStation Store. There's demos. But there That's won't crazy. be a demo for GTA. Why, I, why would I release a demo for a game I know I'm going to make exactly. a billion? Yeah, well, 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 you try it. For who? For what? Yeah, you'll take it when you get it, man. I was like, wait, one year for this McDonald's game. McDonald's doing a taster of a, bur- <laughs> of a Big Mac. Like, oh, you don't know if you like Big Mac? Good, go home. Um, last, last game I clocked was Super Mario Odyssey. On the Switch. Clock? Oh Ma- Clock Mario? Mario Super Mario Odyssey, yeah, the last one. Okay. On, on, on what con- console? Nintendo Switch. That's Wii. No, that's, that's Wii. Wii. But Switch does that. That right? one is terrible. We got that. Yeah. I tried to break it with my teeth in half. I hate that console, man. Yeah, I hear it. I saw oh. this. The, 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 the um, remote control or whatever, the pad is like this. It's like an arm. Yeah, I hear it. No. Worst console ever. Sorry, Nintendo, but that one was bad. It was the like, biggest selling ever. Like, the crowd buy anything. Nah, it was mums and that as well. Crowd buying lockdown, yeah, they were buying cause, cakes. Because they used to do the fitness thing on it. Lockdown, yeah. they were buying cakes. What's During right? lockdown, they were buying cakes. Oh, yeah, they were. Yeah, please, man. The crowd, you bought, the last three years, you bought rubbish. Crypto, you bought rubbish last three years. Don't come and tell me this rubbish. You bought yeah. rubbish. You said the crowd are the worst, worst yeah. people in the year. Oh, oh, what? To buy stuff? Online? I'm trying to buy dungarees. What are you lot buying? <laughs> <laughs> get, the, get, get the hell out of here, man. Lockdown, they bought cakes. <laughs> terrible, man. <laughs> Uh, do you, can, we, can I get back to the pigs? Yeah, of course, sorry. An exploding population of hard to eradicate super pigs in Canada is threatened to spill south of the border and northern states, including Minnesota, North Dakota, and Montana, are taking steps pigs to stop the say, invasion. They, they still make the same noise they used to make back in the day, innit? What noise? <laughs> Guys, surely they got to switch it up. Animals can't be making the same noise. For 20, 30 years, T. Of course. Otherwise, Why? the kids' books that you read them, the cow goes So they're going to blow their nose and snore the whole time? Yeah. <laughs> no, I'm not at that, T. I'm sorry. Pigs need to go. Instinct. Well, pa- apparently in Canada, the wild pigs roaming Alberta, Saskatchewan, and Manitoba pose a new threat. They're often crossbreeds that combine the survival skills of wild Eurasian boar with the size and high fertility of domestic swine to create a super pig I've seen that's spreading pigs. out of control. They're brown. Right. I think they're brown. I've seen Why are pigs. they hard to eradicate? I think because uh, they've got the size and high fertility of the Eurasian boar. Right, let me ask you a question. Which what? means they're constantly having babies. So you can kill a set, but there's loads more having babies. And um, So there's more being born than being killed. Yeah. But how do they attack? Because pigs don't bite. Pigs bite? Pigs, but what? Pigs bite, bro. Pigs can eat through bone. No way. Pigs are not native to North America. Have you never heard feed them to the pigs? I've heard that, but I thought they were talking about the police the whole time. <laughs> the police don't. <laughs> no. <laughs> In the late 80s, apparently, the Canadian farmers were encouraged to, to raise wild boar. Uh, and the market collapsed in 2001. And uh, that meant some farmers just let their boars out, let them roam. Um, and then that meant that this new population of boars were breeding with pigs. And now they're a super breed that are hard to kill. And they're like rats the way they keep populating. And how are they going to invade the US? They can have six piglets in a litter and raise two litters in a year. So there's one, twelve. one girl so, can have 12 pigs a year. And pigs are big. They're smart. They're, they're horny. Heavy. They're heavy. They're, horny. they're powerful. They're horny. So are they like foxes here? Do they just... Well, that's the fear. That's what they. That's what America's worried about. Because over in Canada, it's it. I like that. If we, I, I feel like every country should have a bunch of animals roaming around. Yeah, but they've already probably got raccoons. As that. long as they're not attacking. Because fox. What I like about foxes when foxes are doing their thing, they're not really attacking. I don't like them. When a fox sees me, gone. No, no, the, the foxes in my, where I live now. Obviously, the ones in the city, they're getting a bit more brave, yeah, brave. aren't they? Yeah, now they, they want to move. So. I think every like if if um, in America if they've got wild pigs going around, good on you. you but you got to take into account that they've caused around two point five billion damage to U.S. crops every year, 
and they can be aggressive and Crops. they killed a woman in Texas Crops. in 2019. It's far, he's talking about farms. Yeah, not everyone in America has a farm. It comes, where do you think the, the stuff comes from? The factories. America's a kid. Uh, America, America's a lie. It all starts with the crops, though. But also, a woman was killed in Texas by wild pigs in 2019. Well, uh, one, we've had one, one, one death for uh, three years. That, what's that? Is that? It's true, you know. <laughs> it's true. <laughs> it is true. <laughs> yeah. She had a cardiac arrest. Her thing's different. <laughs> cardiac arrest from a bite. Uh, it's true. Uh, I hear it. Invade the US. So you're saying maybe we should think about getting roaming pigs. No, no, no. no we've no. got foxes. No, yeah. We're, they've we're, got foxes over there as well. Right, and raccoons and skunks. Oh my God, so they've got, we, we are saying we need three, four more. I'm, I'm not saying they've that. They've got deer in that too. We've got stags. No, you got stags. <laughs> they're just, they're growing. <laughs> they're not <laughs> they coming to the city. Playing dead. They're not coming to the city. Specs, I thought this one, this new story might help you because it's kind of a, a, a Rishi story. Mm -hmm. McDonald's, a McDonald's branch has banned teenagers from entering the restaurant at night. It almost got me, but it needed to say it during the day. Yeah. <laughs> because obviously, you know, I have my family meetings at McDonald's. With my dad's family. That's that that's the place that, that's the restaurant they like to sit and to, you know some families like to go to the, to the strand. Yeah. So my dad's family would like to go to McDonald's. So daytime would have been perfect. So what's, what's their thinking? Apparently in Fort William in the Scottish Highlands, uh, under 18s will not be allowed in the store after 6 p.m. Uh, apparently yeah. Police Scotland said it was aware of incidents of antisocial behavior and was working with, on meaningful solutions for young people in the community. But McDonald's said I, it I won't like tolerate abuse of its employees. I, I, I like that. First year of college, I remember when we used to finish our you know, uh, class, we used to go to McDonald's and just sit down, play music, rap, just chill at McDonald's because it was cold as well. That was like the warm, like the warm spot. But you got to remember, it's a restaurant. People are eating. You don't just sit there and, and you know how if, if there's a mummy dinner that you fancy, you're gonna play hide or it yeah. inside McDonald's, running past people. Fake throw the you know what I mean? Burger, yeah. And then she, she might even when she uh, we're playing hide or it, whatever you want to call it, tap me in the rib. I'm ticklish. Pop. Now I got this small guy past burgers and stuff. It's not. Fair. So yeah, man, I, li I, I, I like that rule. I like that rule. Or they should have said 18 year olds or teenagers in there no longer than five minutes. Where, if you could ban teenagers from anywhere, where would you ban them from? Westfield. Westfield. Shopping centers. That's the shopping center thing, bruv. Friday, Westfield, Stratford. You got schools, assembly. TikToks. School assembly in Stratford Westfield. Bally's every year's got a balaclava on tea. Nah, man, ban that. See that uh, Philadelphia mm. has banned um, face masks and ball ballies. Uh, I like it, man, T. I like it. it. Does that make you sound old? No, because I'm not old. Well, I told you I had a problem with the delivery drivers coming, knocking the door. Obviously, I know my food's coming, but I look, I've still got to check my mirrors and look through the peephole of my door. And there's a guy ballied up, and now I've got to make a decision. You look through the people. Yeah, always. There's, that's, 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 why, that's why it's on the door. You look through the people. I don't have a people, but yeah, I look through the blinds. Yeah, always have to look. Yeah, but I look through the window. I've got a people. I just look through the window. Same thing. Well, you got a better view. No one uses a people. You, got, you can see. You can see I don't think he has glass on his door. You can see delivery drivers back off as well. <laughs> yeah, yeah, the way my house is, the way my house is set up, I actually can. Like ban ballies, I don't like ballies, I don't like ballies. Every time I see someone with a bally, I'm always thinking, what are you on? I've got my business, always. Mm. Generally don't have a problem with teenagers though. I don't think I've ever had, I don't think I've had many Even if you're, me neither, them. they're just loiterers. Yeah, they're just hanging just about. Just loiterers. Yeah. Yeah. They're just loiterers. Ban them from Twitter. Did you know Big Ben's not called Big Ben? What? If you say <laughs> Big John or Big Harry, <laughs> I'm gonna flip. I don't know if they changed the name. It's called the Queen Elizabeth Tower. Oh, phew, that's fine. Okay, yeah, that makes sense. Just don't say Big John or be a different name. What's that wrong with John? Speaks. Big Ben, it's not Big Ben, it's Big John now. What? Can't do that, bro, come on. Come on. But it's never been called that, apparently. I know there's someone called Big John out there, by the way. Yeah, there's loads of Big Johns. Everyone, everyone. I told the story on when we did the uh, Bournemouth episode about how my neighbor growing up played for Bournemouth and he scored Bournemouth's only goal at Wembley. Wow. His name was John, his son's name was John, and his dad's name was Big John. That's not, that's not creative. T. Legendary family, by the way. T, balance in the books. 
Were they, were they you or me? They were me. Thank God for that. Big John. Well, everyone's black, called John Black in the Johns. House. Is that Black John? Yeah, that's Black John. <laughs> everyone's called John in the house. Um, I'm going to get another story out here. This is from Scripps News. And this is, this is about America, but I'm guessing the same is the same here. Mm. He said Scripps News. Close. Forget Black Friday. Plumbers beware for Brown Friday. That don't sound right. That's, that, that's like Stephen Felix's stuff. Well, it is. <laughs> what? Because, because apparently plumbers oh. get more calls than any other day, the about, day after about, Thanksgiving, about when toilets. everyone's been eating the turkey and all the food. So I'm guessing Boxing Day is probably the biggest day for plumbers in the UK. Because in the UK, it's even bigger than Thanksgiving. When's the last time you called a plumber? I n- never in my life. Me neither. Wait, hold, it depends. What, it, what are you calling a plumber for? That's, that, 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 let's, let's just be clear on that. Have you called a plumber? I, my cousin locked himself. <laughs> <laughs> That's a locksmith. You called a plumber. <laughs> oh, this is the cousin that stayed last year. You called a plumber because he was locked in the bathroom. Yeah. <laughs> You're a waste of time. I swear so to God. So locksmith and plumber is not the same thing? No. <laughs> That's why when I was calling all these plumbers, they're like, oh, we don't do that. I said, what do you mean you don't, you don't do that? Your number's here in, in Yellow Pages. You called a plumber? Okay, so plumber come to pick the, fix the pipes. Yeah, yeah. yeah. All right, let me ask you this. Sure. My cousin's locked in the in my bathroom like last time. Yeah. You heard the story already. But the pipe in the bathroom is not working. Yeah. You tell me I've got to call the locksmith and the plumber. <laughs> Absolutely, <laughs> yes. yeah. So the plumber can't come and sort out the door to get into the pipe. I, do you own a screwdriver? I do. I, I got a screw. You know what I got? Screwdriver that it has got a box and then you can take the top off and it's got all sizes. The best product in the world, by the way. Mm-hmm. Yeah. But I will you never use it. the it. other day. I will never use it. Uh, getting in, getting getting through a door that doesn't want to open is the easiest thing in the no, world. No, it's not. You don't need to phone T, anybody. You, you, your hand looks like a brick, so it's different. With me, <laughs> whoever, whatever plumber has locked the original screw I'm trying to take out, not plumber. That's really locked. It's not. So, you're, you're, so I've got to use my foot when I'm twisting that out. You're better off phoning one of your neighbours, like Tinchy Strider or Professor Green, to come than phoning a plumber. Or use the gym membership you got. Yeah. To get stronger. I'm not getting stronger just to open screws. Let my, let my cousin in, the, in that bathroom <laughs> couldn't give a sandwich. But yeah, Brown Friday. Brown Friday. So that's, I think Boxing Day is Tuesday this year, right? I don't even know when Christmas is. Yeah, me too. Christmas is Sunday, no? I think Christmas is a Monday. Do you know 2024 starts on a Monday? Christmas is on the Monday. Boxing Day is on the Tuesday. Well, yeah, January 24 starts on a Monday. January 1st that's is Monday. That's class. By the way, you lot are... You're free... You're free you're free to you're free to welcome you're free to welcome to my house on Christmas Day. Oh, are we? Yeah. You live far. One well, day you don't, I will. You don't live far. One day from I will. I've got my I've got my own family. It's, come. Uh, it's a long drive. That's just coming. That. You that is going to be your excuse for Peek ever. Come. Peek can come. Nah, because once my kid can do stuff, it's fine. But the kid can just cry in the back of a car right we've now. We've got a plate for Dazza, isn't it? Who has two? We we've got a plate for Dazza. You've got a plate for him. Yeah. I thought you said oh, we've got, got to pay for him. We've got to pay for him. No, we've got to pay yeah. for him because he's asking going to be very quick. Are you going to get him a present? Huh? Dada. No. Have you ever got him a present? Yeah. There was a video I did where I got there's a pe- present. I was outside his house in a car. Yeah. He came in. He I remember that. A present. It was a bunch of nothing. Oh, yeah, I, I just remember. gave you a present. Mm-hmm. Can we kick that off as being like you giving people presents this year? Do you, have, you ever got your, have you ever got your boys presents? No. But. Do you want a present for me? Yeah, I'll, I'll get to your present. Oh. I'll get I'll get you a lot of present. That's not a present. <laughs> <laughs> this, you know, <laughs> this is you're very cheap. You're very cheap. You're very cheap. <laughs> he is cheap still. Next no rules, I'll get you um not you actually. You a present. Do you what do you know what I want? Do you know what I want for Christmas? So the first time about I know what I want for Christmas. Before so I'm gonna ask you and I'll ask but it's up to you lot. I want black Tims. Okay. And an Averex jacket. Which Averex jacket? Any leather Averex jacket. I don't care what kind. Have you been on the website? Nah, no, he saw you and said I need that. Yeah, I saw your jacket. Uh, Brown, Brown, Fri- Brown Friday though. Oh yeah, poo. Plumbers going crazy. By the way, are plumbers allowed to, can I ask you a question? You're a plumber, you go in someone's house, change pipes. Your buddy decides, oh God, <laughs> I need to release. <laughs> yeah, that's the way. Do you, look, do you now use their toilet and release or what? You could say, yeah, I needed to test it. I had to put something through there. Me and Podolski once had an argument when the locksmith guy came in. He went on the stairs with his shoes on. I switched. Yeah, that's mad though. 
Yo, they're wearing boots on my stairs and it looks muddy. Yeah, that's mad. It's true. What are they doing? Why <laughs> do they just take it off? <laughs> that is mad. You can see the house is clean. But them man don't like taking their shoes off and that. Why? Because you know they got last week's socks on. And would you rather that? Yeah. They're not just, not, boot, not 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 outside shoes on the steps. Kicks like just kicks of not cheese. Not on that. You know what's more offensive to you, T? Um, a fart or like bad feet? Bad feet. Bad, bad, yeah, bad feet stays. Because you have a bad day with farts. Bad feet is. It's uh, it's, it's it's a bad slap feet in the face. It's not gonna go. Yeah. It's not bad feet. Go, ba- yeah. Bad bad feet. Like the smell of bad feet. Actually, they get seats and stay in the house. I don't. I don't. I'll be, I don't let people come in my house though. I'll I'm not. I'm not very house. welcoming. Yeah. You, yeah. But you came in when there was. Tents up. Yeah, people don't come in my house. But you could come in. You could come. You two could come in. But generally, I don't, I'm not. I'm not big on letting people in. Are you a fan of um, people knocking for your coming? Like Blanca and Ash, just knock it, saying, "Yo, I'm downstairs," no. without telling you that uh, I'm coming. No, oh, definitely not. Oh. That's crazy. <laughs> there's only one person. There's only one person that can do that, Jeez. and it's because yeah, because I, yeah. I can't stop him. Yeah, you have. Well, Dazza can do that. But you know what I do though? Because I just leave him. Like you just, I'll go upstairs. We're going to do one more No Rules News story. And it's from NDTV. Woman punches husband to death for not taking her to Dubai on birthday. Woman punches husband to death. Yes. For not taking her to Dubai on her birthday. Wait, hold on, hold on, hold on. My, my, my brain, my brain is, wants to leave this head right now. Woman punches man to death. But why isn't the man blocking the punches? <laughs> this is what I'm saying. Everyone needs to watch WWE. Undertaker's the best at it. You know Undertaker does that? Nah, that's new though. Yeah, that's new Undertaker, yeah. Class. Mm, that is new actually. Why are we not blocking? Well, maybe she's like Brock. You oh, can't Brock's block, daughter. you can't block Brock. Yeah. Brock's daughter is sensational. <laughs> yep. You, you <laughs> right. Sorry. Sorry, I have a finish. <laughs> sensational, um, discouraged. <laughs> okay. <laughs> What's that mean? <laughs> I, I, I'm trying to make it mean what I, I'm seeking T. Let's not be rude about Brock Lesnar's no, daughter. I would, no, I would, T, I would definitely. <laughs> yeah. No. You know what I mean? No. That's Sable's Stop. daughter. That's Sable's daughter. Yeah, talk about Sable. Sable's. Yeah. But the daughter's beautiful, man. In that way. And she, she could punch you up. In that way. But I wouldn't be with her. She could punch you to death, though. I wouldn't be with a woman that can punch me up to death. She's a situation. And you can't block. But there's situations out there that can't punch me to death. I will try my best with Chloe Barrows. I can block her blow about his punches. Chloe can punch you to death. She can, innit? Yeah, Specs. Chloe can punch you. She can pick you up. I can pick her up as well. With her. <laughs> Reverse. Reverse. So it's a draw. Reverse. It's a draw. She can't missionary me. <laughs> <laughs> oh my God. For not taking her to Dubai. What was in Dubai so bad for you to go and punch up your, your husband? Apparently the victim identified as Nikhil Khanna, a businessman in the construction industry, had a love marriage with love marriage with, <laughs> with his wife Renuka six years ago guys Dubai's overrated isn't it let's be honest it's very, it's not I've been there I, 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 I went there six seven years ago and I've, n- I've never thought about going back there boys I still ain't been you went with Poet T even when I was there it's not a big deal it's not a big deal well nowhere's a big deal mm. no Ibiza's a big deal Ibiza when you got Ibiza you'll be like oh, no, I'm coming back here next year surely some places are big deals man I, I yeah know. some places are big deal yeah Vegas these childish places you're saying. Nah, be for serious. Okay, all right. Let, let, let's talk honeymoon. Okay. Maldives, you want to go back? I've never been Maldives. Um, what's You've that one? You've been Maldives? No, no. <laughs> but I've typed you know it in. Maldives, you want to go, you wanna go <laughs> back? I've typed it in YouTube. <laughs> and I want to go back. <laughs> if you could go back anywhere in the world in your uh, travels, where would you go right now? Cancun. I've got unfinished business. In with or without Dazza? With or without Michelle? Oh, without Michelle. Without Michelle. Who's better on holiday, Dazza or Podolski? Podolski. Yeah. Podolski's more in- adventurous. Yeah. Let's go here, let's go there. Dazza won't do anything. Dazza's want to eat chips all day. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and dress up and look in the mirror. <laughs> you, t- that all, you know, take Dazza, you could take Dazza Glasgow, tell him he's in Uruguay, and just give him Give him mirrors. <laughs> <laughs> That's a, Uruguay is the best place he's ever been to. You're not, you're not wrong. <laughs> you're not wrong. <laughs> Uruguay. <laughs> so T, was it one punch or more than one punch? It was multiple punches, yeah. Multiple punches that took her husband down for not taking and her to the And she's gone to jail. Birthday. She has gone to jail, yeah. 
You know what, yeah? Obviously, on my um, algorithms on Twitter, there's a lot of... Um, I watched, like, one video of a fight. Yeah, you know, like, in America, there's always a fight in high school. And now bear fights keep coming up, innit? And uh, I'm seeing these fights where people are getting knocked out and having seizures now on the floor. I think, R Sunak, even though it's not your country, I think you need to really give people, like, 39 years for having a fight. I think it's so dangerous now. Ah, uh, uh, yeah, I hear it. I got them pages on my timeline, too, and I started going through them. And if you go in the replies, there's a page dedicated to giving context. Okay. To these fights and weird situations. Someone that does viral. the research. Yeah, yeah it's exactly. so sick. Too, it's yeah. too much. There's too much of like, boom. The, the, everyone's fight. Okay, they're fighting each other, and someone drop, hits the ground, and then their arms fold like that, and then, yeah, they turn you to the side, and I'm just like, that, that, this isn't, th this ain't cool. You gotta turn them to the side, mum. This ain't cool. Well, we'll be back in the new year, 2024, new year of no rules. We've got big plans for No Rules next year. Shout out everyone on Spotify, everyone shout on, on Spotify. Apple Podcasts, audio. Merch, uh, merch next year, definitely. No, sorry, it's, it's, it's sorry, shout out, do you wanna, it's ready. Do you want to put a dream guest on? Like, do you want to put a dream guest on the table now for next year? What, and not say it? No, 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 no just who, 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 who's your dream guest That's for next year? Oh, boys, you're putting me in the shadow, shadow of Apollo here. <laughs> what does that mean? <laughs> you're putting me in the shadow, um, shadow of Apollo. Dream here. guest. So you got one? Flipping hell. I think uh I think I'm torn between two. David We are oh. or Ella Hughes. Unfinished business. Yeah, you you're you're bang on unfinished unfinished Ella business. Ella Hughes messaged me actually today. This is old man's what? stuff. What? She's still a bat? Yeah. Yeah, Ella Hughes is still a bat. Does she still do porn? Not really. She's like she just chose her cats and reads. Yeah, books. what's she like? What, what, what's what's Ella? I haven't seen Ella Hughes' name in time. I might say Micah Richards. Would no, be great Michael on just, this show. Yeah, I think he'd be great on okay, this show. Okay, Michael's a good shot. And then I might say uh, William Regal. <laughs> T, if William Regal comes on this show, I will never do any guess after. Again. <laughs> yeah, you couldn't, you couldn't beat that. <laughs> William Regal. You couldn't beat that. William Regal. That's true. Have you got one, Jordy? Nah. I just had the question. <laughs> well, off, the, off the top of the head, Chris Tucker. There you go. That's bad, that's bad. What, why? Ah, Chris Tucker's lost it. We'll find it then. No rules show. Filthy5.com, New Jersey out now. Let's see if it hasn't sold out. Hopefully you guys are backing it. Umbro, big partnership. Uh, subscribe on Spotify, Apple Podcasts, obviously YouTube. We love you. Have a great Christmas. See you in 2024. Goodbye. I love you all, No Rules. <laughs>